Richmond Crime Sweep is a partnership of law enforcement agencies that was formed to improve the quality of life for residents by targeting the most violent neighborhoods and offenders. 13 different agencies that are working together, federal, local, and state agencies, all working for the same cause, basically to reduce violent crime in the city of Richmond. And when we have that many people at the table, that many partnerships, good things happen. We reduce violent crime by over 45%. And that's history making right there. Mosby Court, or Mosby Neighborhood, there were three violent... Crime Sweep is a, is a cooperative effort between concerned law enforcement agencies in the Richmond, Virginia area that deploy their resources in a strategic and tactical way that uh, complements as opposed to duplicates one's efforts. We've incorporated a lot of faith-based and uh, social service agencies, the Attorney General's Office GRIP program, and we actually even partner with them to help direct them in the right direction as to what services people need and uh, help facilitate that, uh, or at least get them in the arena with those people so they can do their job well. Thirteen agencies have formed the most extensive law enforcement effort in the history of Richmond. One of the reasons why violent crime in the city has plummeted is the development of a hard-hitting public awareness campaign designed to warn criminals and reassure city residents that violent crime in Richmond will not be tolerated. It's very tangible to see the reduction in crime, especially violent crime, based upon our marketing efforts, whether it be a billboard, whether it be a te television spot, or a bus that has our display on the side. That has an acute reference to what we're doing here in Richmond. The dramatic reduction in violent crime puts people more at ease. It makes the city a more attractive venue for families looking for a place uh, for relocation. Uh, it, it's, it's a more attractive city if you have school-age children because the assumption is the safer the streets are, the better the schools are. We spend an incredible amount of time in Crime Sweep interfacing with the community to remind them who we are, uh, to remind them that they can trust us, and to tell them that we're counting on them for information to solve and prevent crimes. If we don't sell ourselves to the communities, you know, we can only do half of what we've been able to do historically. Crime Sweep uses highly visible community policing such as command staff walkthroughs, outdoor roll calls, and specialized neighborhood policing units to protect the city of Richmond. While programs such as One Stop and the Board of Young Adult Police Commissioners build relationships and resources for the community. The command staff walkthroughs are part of our community policing strategy. Once a month, we remove ourselves from our offices and we bring ourselves to the community in terms of a walkthrough. And it's an assessment. It's an assessment of what the neighborhood needs, uh, what our deployment strategy should be, and how we can better work with the community. And during that time, an entire command staff, about 30 people, will hit a neighborhood with uh, the resources in terms of the officers, second responders, and any other agencies that we may need. And during that walkthrough, we learn quite a bit about what's happening in the neighborhood. One stop is a part of community policing. The strategy here is not just to reduce violent crime and take offenders off the street, but to replace it with resources that are needed in those communities. The One Stop provides those resources, whether it be literacy training, uh, vocational training, um, daycare, whatever is needed for that community to make things better. The Open Court is the largest public housing in the city of Richmond. Over the years, it has been a significant area for violent crime. So a few years ago, there was a Gilpin Court a unit that was established. And they not only address the violent crime issues, but also the property crime that is here in Gilpin Court. Because they're a two-person unit and they spend a lot of time on foot, they've established a really good rapport with all the citizens that are in here. So when there is a significant event, a homicide or a shooting or a robbery, or anything of that nature, they are able to instantly get information and are able to pass that information on to detectives, which is able to affect an arrest and a conviction in court. Sometimes we have to go back to where we've started. And in policing, outdoor roll calls were uh, traditional. And now we're doing them here in Richmond so that people can see the officers, get to meet them, and understand some of our strategies. After every outdoor roll call, officers will assess the neighborhood, walk through, talk to people, and see if they can learn better as to what the needs are. These officers in this sector, they are well versed in the crime, they are well versed in the people that commit these crimes. The community is a lot tighter than it used to be. The people actually look out for each other more so than in the past. 
we as a police, we can't be there all the time, 24 hours a day, seven days a week. So we need eyes and ears to help us out. And we get a tremendous, a lot of support from the community. Crime Sweep has given us this opportunity to really extend our community policing strategy in ways that we couldn't have done before. Without Crime Sweep, we would not be where we are today.